Hi, so I want to update the firmware of my DCO oscilloscope because it can uh, it doesn't trigger uh, around uh, 50 milliseconds or uh, above that and I want to get uh, the uh, a trigger on the voltage of my car battery uh, and I'm gonna show you now what version I have on this So as you can see it's uh, 060, 060, you need the uh, version 60, 66, it's only available on the forum, I'll put the file in the description. Okay, so in order to do this, you need uh, two things, so first thing, you need one of these, it's a uh, USB to serial adapter they are quite cheap but in case you don't have you need to buy one of these okay so the way you connect it you have this connector here and you need to connect to the three wires ground receive and transmit I use the screwdriver to push this uh, connectors through the case in case you have the case on and the way you connect it on the adapter so ground goes to ground but uh, you need to make sure you put the other to right so receive goes to transmission and transmission goes to receive the other way around on this one Okay, next thing you need to put a bit of solder on this jumper 1 and jumper 2. So it needs to go into bootloader mode. Alright, so you insert your adapter. It will appear in uh, device manager. You can find it here, device manager. Um, you need, you, because you will need to know this number, COG3. Next you install the flash load, loader. I will leave a link in the description. Okay, and here you select the port. I'm gonna remove protection. Flash size 128. And here you will choose 64 or 128 as it was shown on the previous screen. Select download to device. Browse. Uh, we need to view hex files. Now select your 066 uh, firmware. We need to put uh, two checkboxes here. Verify and also the other one as you can see in the right image. Press next. And now we're just waiting to upload the file. It's actually saying download because it's downloading the file from the computer to the microcontroller. So download it's fine. Remove the solder points from here and here. And I'm gonna start it now. So you see we have the new firmware. Okay, so now I'm gonna start the car. And it has triggered. 